can we reward with a nice dinner and say, hey, good job, well done? You know who you need to reward with a nice dinner is J.D. Works hard. Good guy. As I'm doesn't get out. <laughs> but, but J.D., this might not be a night Honey, for J.D. Honey, you're going to be really jealous. I'm going out with J.D. Thursday night. This might not be a night for J.D. <laughs> you want to bring J.D. with us? <laughs> like JD. I mean, it, there's obvious answers back there. You see, all these fucking young kids got married. I don't know, Will and uh, Jason and I've never and even Jason's taken. It's be like Jason's bachelor party right now. I've never even taken Will and Jason out to dinner. But we have. You did once. Yeah, one time. Long but Howard, you should, yeah. Howard. Cinderella. Here, here's one suggestion, and it probably isn't a very good one, but I'll try it anyway. Sal. Oh my God! Well, that's, that's the other good. obvious. That's because good. now there is a situation where you can make up for like not inviting him to the wedding. I love Sal, but he is a douchebag. No. He is yeah, a douchebag, but doing? in that He'll context, be it might be fun. <laughs> uh, some yeah. of the guys in the back, uh, they sent me in as a representative, but they were saying that it's interesting that Artie's sobriety sort of fits for when he needs it. Meaning, Artie didn't go to Will's wedding because of his sobriety, but, but his sobriety isn't keeping him from the Playboy right. match. Well, no, it, 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 it might though. And if Will got married to the Playboy mansion, that would have been great. Well, no, it might. I, no, I'm having a discussion about Listen, it. Listen, Gary, I had a tell the guys about, well, to wake up and smell the coffee. Steve. Going to Will's wedding ain't the same as going to the Playboy Mansion. Yeah, Will, first cool. of all, got married in two fuck bum fuck Saratoga. Uh, Saratoga. In Saratoga, three hours away. I mean, that's a lot to ask people to do for your marriage. But already's going to go six hours on a plane. Well, it's the Playboy. Yeah, but it's the Playboy Mansion. Uh, I mean, what, compare the two. Do we have Will's to say wedding? It? Playboy Mansion. With his father no, in a kilt. With the Playboy Mansion, let me explain to what it is. It's 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 like dying and going to heaven. Will's wedding ain't like dying and going to heaven. It's I, just I, dying. No, I completely understand that. Good. But I All think right. it's just Let's funny that you use the excuse of sobriety. Why don't you say, no, your wedding's going to be lame. I don't want to travel three no, hours. No, I, I, I didn't there, think that. There, are some, things Will, you're didn't to, think there that. are some things you're willing to test your sobriety for. Right. I got that. <laughs> Not your wedding. It's just funny. All right, get out of here. Yes, so, sir. See Saratoga. Ninety percent of the people he knows are in Manhattan. He goes and goes up to Saratoga. Why don't you go to Guam, maniac? <laughs> so uh, what a that's, nut job. No, that's where Jason's getting married. Guam, New Jersey. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> I I you know agreed to go to Jason's. So he invited me. I'm that's very nice. happy. And I said, gee, I really would like to go support Jason and you know his marriage and everything. But and it's right in Jersey. It's fine. I don't ever heard of Hackettstown, but I figure it's somewhere reasonable. Now yeah, I'm here. I figure it must be North Jersey. He's Northern Jersey. Yeah, I, I'm busting balls. A hour little and a half there. drive. Uh, well, that, so that's I'm what gonna, the... I'm going to spend about a half hour to an hour at his wedding before his mom starts bugging me, and then I'm going to leave. <laughs> and so I'm sitting there going, I'm going to be in the car an hour and a half each way, three hours. Beth's fine. She sleeps in the car. She <laughs> nice. passes out like a dead person. I wish and I could I sit do there that. picking my asshole. Oh my god! The only time you I don't can sleep play in the chess. A... And uh... the only time I can sleep in a car is when I'm driving. Oh, stop <laughs> it. I, I, honestly, I fall asleep and then I can't go to sleep when I get the fuck home. Yeah. Well, but no, I was busting balls a little bit about Hackettstown. It's not that bad. And his, I mean, Jason's mother is very nice. I had a great three-hour conversation with her once at the Stress Factory. <laughs> is that why they named it the Stress Factory? Uh, <laughs> it used to be called something else, like Zanies, and then they <laughs> and already stressed out. But I, yeah, so we'll go Thursday night. We'll go out, me and you, and want to want to go to the Howard TV guys. Uh, I like those guys. The pace, good. I like yeah, a lot Brian, of the guys. You know, Brian's take out guy. your buddy Brian. Who's Brian? Brian Phelan. That's my boy. <laughs> I love that guy. Yeah, Brian actually. Uh, Who's, who do you who do you think is fun around here? Who would you like to have dinner oh, with? Oh, Brian Phelan, absolutely. Would you, no, no what, what, forget Brian Phelan for a Yeah, me. that's easy. Who, who are your? <laughs> who uh, if are I had you, a pick from, from this you, group, you know, I'm not the most fun. So right. pick pick uh, pick a couple of guys who you Who's think are fun? real fun. Real fun. You know, is it Baba Booey's no fun, right? Well, no, I like Gary. Gary's right. my kind of guy. Scott DePace is my kind of guy. So who's the guy? Uh, but who's the guys? Doug Scott Goodstein. DePace? I like. Um, uh, you like Doug Goodstein? Yeah, I do. Sure, I like no. Doug. I don't like the way he stares at me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go to a place with bad lighting. <laughs> you don't see his eyes. Guy gets like very intense since he had that eye surgery, that LASIK. He's like this. <laughs> <laughs> what about, the, well, John Hine? John Hine's a great guy. Yeah, I mentioned John Hine. You didn't seem to pick up on that. You want to go out with John Hine? I like all these guys. Uh, Phelan I like a, Doug, too, honestly. Yeah, Phelan is a great guy to go out with, though, though. And, uh You would never eat with Benji, though, would you? I wouldn't. Is I Benji mean, fun? Benji could come later for drinks. <laughs> Benji could stop by at the end. <laughs> Benji, I'm just busting your balls. Yeah. I'm thinking about you. I love you.
love you. Fred we don't even consider. Isn't that funny? I was thinking I nobody him. has said Fred. <laughs> I thought of Fred, but he's he, he uh, uh, never shows up to anything. Really? Yeah. He's always busy with his daughter. Which is cool. Well, I, I mean, am busy, I'm, but I have shown up to many things yeah. recently. So yeah, he yeah. showed up to my place. Yeah, but you notice you don't even notice him. Oh, stop it! I'm just fucking with him. You're terrible. He knows it. That's hey, love Fred. <laughs> you want to go to dinner, Fred? That's his job. Want to go to dinner? No. I would do it. It'd be interesting. Right. It'd be like a good you night. Might want to reconsider that. Will you? Will you go with us? I would go. Sure. I'm sorry, Artie. Uh, you know, if, 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 if it's bum, bumming out Artie. I'm kidding. It's not bumming out Artie. Fred, are you kidding? I are you really believing that? I don't, you know. What it's would like, be the worst he'll night? You'll be back on China White in, in no time. What would be the what Why am I getting yelled at for I Howard? I couldn't have that on my conscience. Yeah, Artie, thanks a lot for making Fred mad. China White sounds so good. <laughs> so, uh, what would be the worst night? Let, who would be like two guys sitting the at the table? Me, you. Scott Salem. Scott the engineer and who else? <laughs> Okay, that's a great question. Well, Scott Salman. Uh... <laughs> Me, Artie, and Scott Salman. Oh, that would be... That's, that, that, that's a sitcom. All right, so you're in, Fred. It's me, I'm you, in. and Artie. And now we got to get two two more fun guys. But if guys. Scott's going, I can't go. <laughs> <laughs> two more fun guys. Yeah. Benji's busy. He bangs on uh, Thursday. Now, he night. brought up Scott DePace. And, yeah, I like and Scott. even though he's a, a fathead Republican, he's actually a neat guy. He's a fun guy. All right, Scott DePace. Yeah, and I'm who not else? political with this shit. I don't care. Suddenly, I don't see Beth getting very jealous of his night. No, I know. I th- as a matter of fact, I think Beth's going to be fine with it. <laughs> Are you only talking <laughs> well, about now inside let's invite a girl. these corridors? Robin, are you saying we need to expand it? Yeah. Oh, good. The pace can't. You want fun people. The pace can't go. It's the World Series. Oh, good. it's like the okay. Phillies. Are, yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. This is like a religious good, thing. Good, good. that big a puss. Boy, we really wanted you, but okay. Uh, if my team was in the series, I would. Sorry. It's a tough thing to go with. You were considered. Uh, maybe, maybe I should just invite Ross because he's fun. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's right, fine. Yeah, sure. So, all right, me, you, Fred, and Ross. And if it's Nobu, Richie might be floating around. Right. Right? Richie, Richie could might be, be around. There. Richie's always good. He's always away. He got married. Now he just travels all the time. Would you want to take Jason as sort of like a pre-married, you know, mm. I don't know, maybe a night out? Which <laughs> Can he lose a few pounds before Thursday? <laughs> Me and Jason are not going to fit on the elevator. I like Jason. <laughs> I do, too. He's a good guy. When, when Jason has to do a task for you, dude, it really is you have to turn away because I'm ashamed to be a man. <laughs> Like, what do you mean? What does he yeah, do? Like if he if, if you ask him to do something, like you need something. Like I saw him running for Will, like you wanted. I think you needed your lunch or something. Yeah. Jason runs out like there's a four alarm fire. He does all right. And then Jason. And it's not like it's not like a smooth run. Like he's he's moving. <laughs> like, how about Jason and JD? Uh, listen, I, I I'm Here's with JD group. every me, weekend. I like it. <laughs> me, you, Fred, Teddy? Ross, J- Teddy. Well, you know, Teddy, I don't know. Teddy's a good guy. I don't really, but Teddy, you know, I don't know Teddy. Yeah, he's aggravating for you. Right. Really? He's already annoying. Do you want to interview him for (laughs) a squad? I might throw something All right, so who's going to dinner with us? Me, you, Fred, Ross, and uh, Jason and JD? JD, I'm sure it's free. You want Richard? I like Richard. I like Sal, though. Richard, Richard comes with Sal. Sal. Richard nah, and Sal I think, are a team. I think he go without Sal. Nah, I, I can't. Sure he would. I, I gotta can't have break Sal. him up again. I'm I would breaking su- him up. I would suggest uh, if we were going to do that. How about Richard and Sal? Richard and Sal, yeah. I would suggest and so, J- so J.D. and Jason are out. You can't, can't take them and Sal and Richard. <clears throat> well, it's starting to get a big table. No I one's going to be able to talk mm-hmm. to each other. See, I'm thinking you ought to invite Sal, Evan. Sal says he's not interested in going. Please take Richard. Oh, Ooh. really? He doesn't want to go? Yeah, but he said it in a very insulted tone. Oh, Why? see, he thinks... I like Sal. I was well, going to try and bond. He's right, the drag him. in keeping I'd Richard out of it. I'd say you invite Sal. If he turns you down, then he's blown Well, he down. just turned us down. Oh. I think you know, Richard's got a Coheed and Cambria concert on oh, Thursday. Oh, okay. Oh, that's no, Richard. Right. What about Ethan? Who's Who? Ethan? Who's Ethan? Oh, Ethan. You're talking about the surfer. No, no, no. I'm thinking... Is it Ethan Who? or Evan I'm thinking Evan about? you're Evan. thinking Evan. about. You're thinking about the guy who surfs and he's like mm. karate man. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. He'll take I think he cap. might be fun. Yeah, the guy who beat up a thousand guys in the Denny's yeah, parking lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what about the uh, Chuck Zito? I know it'll piss Robin off if we take Greg. <laughs> take Greg. I don't care about. Uh, the... <laughs> you don't like Greg. How about Jim Florentine? <laughs> <laughs> take him too. <laughs> Where's that? What's that David Beckham kid doing? Take there? Mark. Take uh, you know Greg, what? Mark. Let's forget the and, whole dinner. And... <laughs> Sounds like a real bummer. I'm going to stay home. <laughs> I think we're describing a sad night. <laughs> Can't you put together a good fun night? Give me, give me five guys who are fun. Me, you, you, I mean, that Fred. me and you know together? Yeah. A mutual friend? Who's fun? I, listen, I always have a good time with Fred, so there's three well, of us. Well, Fred's in. 
Ralph is a good time. You're not mentioning Ralph? Ralph and Jimmy Kimmel? Ralph steals money. You want to do a lottery on that? (laughs) Just put some names in a hat and just yank it out and see what happens with that? No, he said fun. He doesn't want to take a chance. But, I mean, you put some fun guys in there. Well, I think Well, the other thing, we couldn't fill up a teacup with fun guys. I'll tell you one thing. It's too bad (laughs) Jillian Barbary isn't on this coast. Why? She could be like the Angie Dickinson yeah. of that. Of your little if we rat had pack. someone on the East Coast, well, that means unless you want to somebody. call her and have her fly in just to be a part just of Just have hot chicks drop by our table. Yeah. Well, no, again, what you what Nobu, you're at, that's what you're going to see, right? They're yeah. hot chicks hanging out at Nobu. Well, Howard, yeah. How well, about I, Tim Sabian? Oh, Tim, he's not I, a hot chick. Tim's fun. Tim, Tim I love. Yeah. All right, so all right. here's the Tim's group. Here's the group. Me, you, Fred, mm-hmm. Tim Sabian. Ross. Ross. JD Scott Green's no Ralph no Scott Green's <laughs> Scott uh, Scott's my girlfriend I, I need him all to myself <laughs> but really why are you leaving Ralph out of all this well Ralph because is Ralph gets to go to everything I, I was trying see. to make it so that some of the guys who don't always get to hang out for dinner mm-hmm. could hang out Ralph and I'm sure it pisses off the JDs and the you know. You know the the the, the even, Sal. even Sal and Richard. They work so hard back there, and I'm serious. I'd rather I I would like to go out to dinner with Sal and Richard and JD and Jason or Will, one of these guys, because you know Ralph always sort of benefits from all, all right. these things, and right. he is a personal friend. But at the same point, I was thinking maybe some guys from work would want to get together. Now listen, it, well, it's, the, the Nobu bar scene, man, uh, is really there's a ton of chicks. There you go. And I wasn't around for these days, but we got like. Uh, I mean, we're rolling in with like A-list celebrity with you, so yeah. that's bait. Man. Yeah, that's but like, I, you know, I'm well, married and I ain't looking. At I know, but I mean, chicks. well, I'll, I'll. No, no, out. but you know, the other guys, you don't want them to actually talk Artie to will a pick woman. Up the crumbs. No, they can. Well, I tell you what, if we need a chick in this group, what about Lisa G? Mm-hmm. Hey, no, right. mm-hmm. You need, you need someone a little you, looser. I, I, the guys told me that out in L.A. that Lisa was so dull <laughs> that <laughs> she. Um, ate an apple before she ate at Nobu. So when she got to Nobu, um, it, you know, she, she was too full. She didn't want to go out. She would just went back to her room. They asked her to come and hang out. I don't know that she's for you. All right. <laughs> that doesn't sound like a fun night. Are there any other channels? Why, was Lisa, G- Why was Lisa G in L.A. anyway? She was the covered cover. celebrity super fan round table. This is what I found out. This is, this, somebody just reminded me. She went to bed at 8 o'clock at night in L.A. Because John and I told her, when you go out to L.A., you should try to, t- try to stay on New York time. Ugh. So she went to bed at 8 o'clock. <laughs> so she was up at 2 in the morning. John Hyde and Lisa G, they're not the two people you think are going to carve up a fun night together. <laughs> Get some sleep. You want to stay on New York time. Okay. Yeah, so you're single. You're in L.A. You could probably go, go out and meet, sleep a, at eight. meet a movie star she and bang them. go down to the or... bar and hook up with, like, Colin Farrell. Have an apple. <laughs> yeah, and, and, by the way, you're going to a great restaurant where they have some of the best food in the world. So eat an apple. And make sure you eat an apple so you don't get fat. Ew. Can I tell you, I went to the Nobu in L.A. The waitresses are <laughs> There she is, insane. our fun girl. Oh, it was the worst advice I ever followed in my life. Because yeah, you were probably up at 1 o'clock in the morning. <sighs> of course. you don't. And eat. then I went to Mel's Diner on Sunset Boulevard. It was me, the waitress, and the general manager at 5 a.m. Oh, you ate an apple before you went to Nobu, so you wouldn't well, get... Well, my... First of all, you know, I wake up at 4.30, so I was yeah. on New York time. Right. And then with the time difference, so I was starving. Right. So I had an apple just to snack on, and so I didn't eat as and much as... And that filled as, you up? <laughs> well, compared to Ganji, who ate everything on the menu... Right. <laughs> he was like the cookie monster for sushi. <laughs> I was thinking, like, who'd be a fun girl that... Oh, I would be fun. Yeah. I hear you're not too fun. No, I was. I it was the worst advice I've ever taken in my life. It ruined my LA trip. You know who's fun, Savannah. Yeah, but uh, I, I, I'm not going there. What about there. Tracy? Tracy's Tracy? always fun. Tracy if, if, she, if we could bring oh. Grillo, she'll yell at Grillo. Oh, That's that, what we want. That Invite Grillo, and Tracy will yell at. <laughs> and let's let Tracy order the top shelf liquor. All right, can I just make a decision here? Yeah, Here's the group. Okay. Help me out with this. Uh, I know, I'm trying. I guess I'm not fun. You? No, you're a lot of fun. <laughs> you're actually fun. You're too much fun with that no, like 20-year-old, you fucking. Excuse right, me. Me, you, you heard what I said. Me, you, Fred. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to g- get some people who don't normally sort of get to go out. All right, well, I mean. Me, uh, you, Fred. There's a reason why they don't get to go out. Right, they're not fun. <laughs> so it's me, you, Fred. Fred, uh, you want to have Benji or no? 
Benji's fine. I mean, Benji. Personally, no, but I'll do it yeah, if you guys ben, decide. Ben. I mean, I'm not looking for Benji. But what a crew. Is this a voting thing? I mean, he's, uh, he's odd. What a crew. That's some crew. You yeah, want to roll, roll out with, it's you not roll like in with Benji? and Pitt. Picture the four of us sitting in the corner, <laughs> mine is show business. <laughs> I'm getting to the point, I don't want to go to this thing. <laughs> Doesn't sound like something you want to be Me, at. you, Fred, and Benji. Gee, I, I didn't up. even consider going with dinner with Benji. <laughs> <laughs> Benji, you don't want to go, do you? I don't know if, if you assume you're being serious. Yes, like I am. you really think of me as an odd person and yeah. and would oh detest hanging out with me. No, I wouldn't want to go. Okay, so you're out. But <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not. But, but if you're just it. kidding, yeah. I mean, it seems it sounds like a fun thing. Yeah. But but you I, probably I don't wouldn't being, like it. I mean, I don't know why you think of me as like so. Un- I don't know. You just you just a, a very very odd. I, guy. I think it all stems back to Doug's bachelor party. Maybe That's that was when things it. Turn. Yeah. Mm. No, I turned before that. I think that just solidified. <laughs> I think since I met you. The turn when you were born, which according to Steve Langford is 41 years old. Yeah, which we don't know. Our first we three days know. were great, man. How about we put you in on the next dinner? <laughs> oh, yeah. That'll happen. That 2012 right. one, I okay, love Okay, now that I'm one. feeling bad. Me, you, Fred, and Benji. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I, I know what will happen. I'll, I'll get there, and everyone will be like, oh, they couldn't come. <laughs> they didn't make it. I'm, I'm ready to cancel. Uh-oh. <laughs> Would it be great if you called no, up but the Benji last second seriously and has a, Benji has a <laughs> not nah, Benji has a sleep schedule I know about. I'm going to respect that. That's going to fuck it up. Yeah, that's what he tells me. I, I I invited him to my party down the shore, and he goes, "I can't go because I sleep days now." It's <laughs> <laughs> like a bat. It's a vampire. <laughs> I mean, what the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> Phelan, uh, I, I, see, Benji gets to sit in here all the time. I want to take a guy who doesn't even get to get any kind of... I, I happen to know that uh, Phelan, uh, Phelan is fine. could use a few drinks right now in his life. Uh, let's, oh, yeah? Yeah, let's, yeah, let's have him come out. All right, so it's me, That's a you, fun time. Fred, and Phelan? Phelan. What about J.D., no? J.D. is always yeah, in. And what about... Well, okay, Ron, and Ross. What about Ronnie? Ronnie Mund? Yeah. The month? It's Montober. Montober? Well, you can't screw it up because mm. all the important things are done. Who, who came in here the other day and called him Ronnie Munt? <laughs> Everyone. Ronnie Gunt. <laughs> Gunt. Now, here's it. Ronnie gets to go to a lot of shit. He got to go to my bachelor party. I right. wanna, and you know what? And Benji was at the bachelor party. Seriously. Weren't you? No. <laughs> no, he wasn't. Well, you weren't on no. oh, shit. <laughs> Oh, hey, listen, know? here, I'll t- if you don't want to invite me, it's fine. No, nah, you know? I'll have you. It's just not sounding like so much fun now. Th- then don't. Then, Somehow then, then, it was when you re- got No, in. I'm serious. Then don't. I want be totally honest. If you totally honest, don't want to, it's fine. All right. One time, Benji, I forget what the event was, but you, someone, you were having something or Rob was having something. Benji came up to me and said, how are you getting there Saturday? And I, I, I this was awful, but it was like a gut react. I said, you're going? Oh. And, went, and Benji did something funny. He went, yeah, I know. It's not as exciting now, right? I go, no. <laughs> I, I, I have another suggestion, especially if JD is coming. Jared. No, oh. I'm not looking to bust his balls. Well, I was going to well, suggest Jared's Jared fun. instead of JD. <clears throat> oh, you forgot Tim Sabian. Is he out? Oh, no, oh, Tim. He was in. All right, so it's Tim me. really is fun, especially yeah. around the fire But now it's going to be a big table. Yeah. I thought it would well, be how a many dis- people are there so far? You know, I never get to really talk to Fred. I never get to really talk to Artie. And then right. all of a sudden it becomes a big table okay. and nobody talks. I got an opening for you. Phelan's out. He's got to work that night. All right, good. Oh. That could be two of us. I hockey. like Phelan, though. How come Benji's not out? <laughs> Bailey, Benji's free. <laughs> Oddly enough. What about uh, Goodstein and, and the pace, too? The pace, well, pace said, said no. He can't. Oh, that's right. He's got to sit Goodstein, I like. Baseball. You, you know what I'm doing? Uh, you know what? And not Let's Jason? Have fi- I tell you what I'm going to do. Will and Jason? Will and Jason are good. Yeah, all right. Is Will, isn't Willie a big Phillies fan? He'll oh, probably be. You know, this is a bad idea. I'm not doing it. <laughs> Forget it. Just forget the whole thing. Are you forgetting it now? Yeah. Could you over. imagine we can't plan a fun night out in New York? <laughs> uh, I don't know if I can. <laughs> You're busy. Uh, <laughs> he's got to find himself something to do. Let's go to uh, Matt. Matt, you're on the air. Then i got to read you some email. Hey, Howard. How's it going, Matt? I know. Uh, I'm just kind of concerned about Sal. Like, it sounds like he's having a lot of problems lately. But uh, his appearance on Howard TV where he's wearing the Gary lips and he just walks into the studio with the underwear over his head is fucking hilarious. How funny is that episode? That's called, what do they call it, the labiaplasty show? Yeah, the one where the two kick the chick out. (laughs) Very funny, though. When Sal was doing that the other day, I was laughing my ass off, and I went, oh, everyone on the radio doesn't know how funny this is because Sal walks in with that Gary mask, and then I said, Gary, why don't you just put some underwear over your lips and we can (laughs) maybe maybe make believe that's what that chick's labia look like. Yeah, you got to give Sal some props. Like, bring him to the the dinner this Sal's the funniest dude. Artie, let's take him out to dinner. I'm for it. Absolutely. 
Come Sal's in. Sal's at the dinner. Yeah. I'm going to get Sal I, I want to get some makeup tips. <laughs> All right, so he's a shithead. We love him. Yeah, he is a good guy. He's a gelhead. Let's get him in here. Do you want to go to dinner? You want to go to dinner or you want to be a douchebag? Am I in the Twilight Zone? <laughs> you want to go to dinner? You know, I'd like to go to dinner with you and I feel... Uh, my treat. What I do don't say? know. We say pal. If you want. You I, don't want to go? I would like to go, but I'm... I'm uh, you got me in such a fucking weird zone after what I did with the wedding. Right. I almost don't trust myself. I, I would be I would be fine going to dinner be with you. Fine. You did good at that other dinner. Yeah, I, I, I did all right. So here's the dinner. Me, you, Artie. <laughs> this guy already knows something's up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, nothing up, right, Art? No, nothing you at You want to be with Sal or should we not? Of course I, I, li- I like I being lo- with Sal. All right. Me, you, Sal, Fred. And uh, who, I was going to say Benji, but what about a JD appearance? Well, oh. why not I think both? JD would I, really appreciate. That. I always have a great time with JD. Do you? Oh, we me, we were in Detroit. We had I the mean, best ben, time. I mean, I love life. Benji, but I, first of all, I don't want to go with twenty-seven people. Right. right. You want to have a small, intimate group. Sal had a good time with JD in Detroit. I remember that. That's tough too in Detroit. Good job, <laughs> Benji. Mind letting JD go to this one? I swear to God, we go to the I next one with you. I don't mind at all. All right. I promise you. <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> he does, but I know he does. He gets his feelings hurt. Well, you, you 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 treat me like an odd schmuck all the time. So yeah, I do. All right, you want to come? No, I'm just thinking. I just think with you there, it's going to be too you're many in, people. You're out. You're, you're in. Your no, mind. it's fine, dude. But I, I mean, I want Benji there. Okay, so no, here it is. You ready? I don't. I don't we got it. We got it. Me, Artie, Fred, he's, he's Benji, and, and Sal, Sal yeah. and no JD. JD. Oh, no, JD. No, JD and Tim Sabian will sit this one out. All right. All right. How's that? Is well, that a good night? Is Benji ruined it, Artie? No. All right. Fred, I think he's fine. I don't know if I can do it if you're there. What? Okay, well, that's fair enough, All but right. it's up to you. Yeah. So maybe you... the rest of us will go. <laughs> <laughs> but wait, this was my dinner. I'm not going. <laughs> Do we not, you guys not want me there? You, are you going to no, be there? No, so you be you definitely be want me there. I just want to be clear. He wants to have a dinner hosted by you without you being right. there. Are you going to be normal? <laughs> you see, you're busting my balls, but you know, I don't ever see you throwing the dinner. I'm throwing the dinner. He eats the dinner. He don't throw it. Yeah. <laughs> Or he throws the dinner. Oh, do you mouth. have to have special things? Benji? Are you going to be a vegetarian, you cocksucker? <laughs> and Benji's the fence. I don't see a whole Wait. lot of dinner throwing around here. Where, where does that tuna come from? Because if it comes yeah, from he's Japan, a vegetarian. I can't eat it. He's not a, you're, are you really a fucking vegetarian? I never said I was a vegetarian. He wanted the vegetarian <laughs> plate at my wedding. Do you want the regular? Did you have the vegetarian plate at my wedding? Yeah, yes, how he was did. it? It was great. Oh, good. All Everything right. there was great. How did many, you say he looked like a rabbit eating it? A big fat bunny rabbit. I never said I was a vegetarian. A big fat bunny rabbit. <laughs> I think that was Richard Christie. Like, you know, that. you have to go out of your way to make a vegetarian plate. The guy's not even but a vegetarian. Howard, I no. was asked, do you want no, the regular? No, but you just say, give me the regular I dinner. Thought was, dude, I, I was asked. Nah, you and don't you know get what? It. I was asked, do you want the vegetarian? Do you want the regular? Or do you have any special requirements? I was like, oh, a vegetarian. Because otherwise I would have said, I don't eat shellfish. I don't eat milk with meat. I don't no. eat pork. So I just said vegetarian. It makes it much simpler. What is it, Richard? Me and JD were just observing Benji all night at the wedding. And they would they brought out these asparagus. <laughs> and he, it only took him like one bite to eat a whole <laughs> asparagus. <laughs> <laughs> and they're, these, they're like a foot long, but he was just challenging. He jammed it in, He's huh? like a Waskly Wabbit. No need for a knife over here. I'll just jam the whole thing into my mouth. Just bring the whole stock, waiter. <laughs> Richard Christie is saying you weren't sophisticated enough right. at the wedding. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right, here's the dinner. You ready? Well, can Richard come? Can he, Richard he come? He said he's going to Coheed in Cambria. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm Baby. sorry. Gay he's gay. I would love to, but yeah. I'm going to a chigger convention. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's my here's my uh, dinner, and here's the time we're getting together for dinner, because I want to go to bed early. I know. Now, All you right. think this is going to make Beth jealous? No. That, uh, that went out the window. <laughs> That's why I say you got you to have one hot chick. I thought Artie and I could have come up with a crew that would make Beth jealous, but <laughs> okay, you, you, you can't swing a dead cat in here without hitting a dull person. <laughs> So it's me, Artie, Benji, Fred. Dude, dude, dude if you're, I don't want to come. It's fine. Really? Yeah. Stop it now. Stop but it. You're being ridiculous. Why? He said. He said. Now he, he knows I'm only inviting him because he's sitting here. Right. I feel bad for him. Hey Howard, do you know who me, you're leaving out? Me, Artie, engineer. Nah, we're not going with him. <laughs> me, Artie, Benji, Fred, um, uh, Sal. Oh yeah, right. Sal. <laughs> Already, you're forgotten. And yeah. JD. Wow. What do you think? Is that a bad night or a good night? I, I think it's great. We have dinner, then we catch uh, the midnight uh, Vicky Cristina Barcelona. <laughs> Sounds good. Now, is that a fun night, Artie, or I don't am think I, I playing anymore? That's a great 
night. I, I mean, I hang out with these guys a lot. You know, I mean, uh, you know, it's great. It is. Seriously? Yeah, sure. Right. Now, are we doing Cheech and Chong or just the dinner? Oh. Ooh. I don't want to go all the way out to Westbury. Well, we could go to a nice restaurant, let's say in Roslyn or something, and then we could go oh, to... No? no, fuck that. Like Mateo's is good. I love Mateo's. Me too. Yeah. My let's, boy Chris runs that joint. Let's, I go to Mateo's. A little dinner at Mateo's. I go there all the time with my daughter. Some nice uh, manjada for uh, Artie and us, and then we'll go right to uh, West yeah, Let's announce you know, it. Let's go there with 5,000 people from West Islip now. <laughs> now, what we're going to do is we're just going to go to dinner in the city. And you no, sure that's going to... Can you handle that? And we're going to meet at early. I'll figure out a time. Yeah, I'm a big fan of Cheech and Chong. You mind eating dinner at 4 o'clock? Well, I was going to say 5. What? <laughs> I'm, a, I'm fine with it. 4 is too early. 5. What if five. Cheech and Chong came I'm in to do the show at dinner? Do you, go, we... do you want to go see Cheech and Chong instead? No, I, well, I'm saying I love Cheech and Chong. So do I. Two 70-year-olds doing pot jokes. I can see that at the Port Authority. They're going to be at Radio City for this in January. We're going to go January. I figure yeah. we'll make a little road yeah, trip. Yeah, Radio there. City is a nicer road venue. trip to me is three blocks. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is uh, actually, I'm looking forward to this. It's going to be nice. All right, we'll have a nice night. Yeah. All right. Now well, we do. Well, I'm the only one hurt now because I don't get mentioned. There's no broads, though. Right. No, you need, listen. <laughs> we need you. You got a vagina. <laughs> you're bring out. that you're Beckham guy around, and we don't need him. <laughs> I'm sure you got something to do with that 23 year old. <laughs> and where were we for the girls' night out? We were never invited to that shit. <laughs> just Jason. All right, Sal. We're All right, going to so try this. We'll give it a shot. See how I, it I goes. So no, fine. Jason. I, the thing I like. I is, love Jason. What am I going to do? Well, I because he's getting he married. Wants a small little dinner. Oh, you want Jason to include him? I'll, well, I just say then you're going to be at a big Jason, table. Jason's going to do super fair round table. Okay, good. And I love how everyone in the studio is invited but me, but I'm busy anyway. Yeah, I've gone to really dinner with you a lot of times. You know, to be honest. What? Jason doesn't really need the meal, to be honest. Let's face it. <laughs> oh. Skipping a meal for what him. Me would be bad. You need a- I'd like. To, I'd love for Tim to go. Tim's a lot of fun. He is. Man. Tim's great. All right, Tim's in then. Tim tells the best. How many guys is that? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, Rage? six. Wait, wait, you got to stop at s- seven. Tim, That's t- seven guys. Tim is six, seven, uh, eight. Come on, be quiet. Tim seven t- guys. Seven, Tim, uh, Tim tells the best seven guys, anti-Semitic gonna... jokes. Does, Does he? he? Oh, it's great. Oh, I'm, yeah. Seven. Great. I haven't heard those. <laughs> seven guys is too much, but okay, I'll up That's Tim's That's seven? Up. It's already up to seven? Yeah. How about this? I'll pay for everybody else. You pay for Tim. <laughs> no, I'd rather pay for everyone else. No, I'll pay. I'm, I'm fine. I thought I got over on you. You've been I'm getting making a little card dinner. game. Now, I tell you, I, this this will be fun. Some good conversation. I'll watch you guys drink. I'll go home and cry at the edge of my bed with a cigarette. Yeah, I'm going to have a few drinks already. That's all right. No, do, do whatever you got to do, man. I'm solid. I'll go down. It's a Thursday night. I'm I'll solid. be uh, By midnight, I'll be Brooklyn uh, winning more money, man. Right. It's a Thursday night game now. All right, boys. We're going to get some uh, dances afterwards, Howard? Nope. Not Nothing. me. Just playing it safe? Like well, playing it safe. Yeah. What are you, trying to ruin this marriage? <laughs> Dude, from what I hear, you uh, you get enough dances during the week. <laughs> I during wish the I day. did. Yeah, right. Bullshit. During the day. Yeah, dancing yeah. my ass out of the kitchen, putting out the garbage, Where do you dancing go? back. Why don't you come clean? Mm. Well, first of all, I go to the greatest place in all of New York, Rick's, Rick's Cabaret. Cabaret. I hear you, you there almost there every... Lunch I hear you there every lunchtime. I wish I was, believe me. You're I, the guy. I, I, first of all, Howard, I can't be there. I'm, I'm here. Every once That's in a while, I, I, I put a few business meetings together, and we have lunch at Rex. <laughs> Monkey business. <laughs> business meetings. What kind of business are you discussing? Lots of business. <laughs> what do you want, Ralph? I think I can go. I just want to double-check the date. <laughs> yeah, you know why I'm excluding you? Because you get to go to everything, and these guys don't. <laughs> That's okay. Check hey, you know what's coming Guess up? Guess you're stuck we... with me, Ralph. You know what's coming up we should do? What? Uh, I have, yeah, I have girls' night out with Robin. <laughs> uh, uh, Don Rickles is in town. Yeah, well, I'm already set up. I'm not looking for you. No, no, no. This, this, this is this week. I know. Oh, oh, oh you're going. Oh, I got. It. I'm not looking for you. That's oh. what he does. He figures out what I'm going yeah. to, and then, and then he, he. Oh yeah, yeah. He that's that's right. He's the Cato Kalen of the Stern Show. You didn't that's know that. What I'm busy that's doing. Right. Good. That's All why right. I went to see All Don right. Rickles in Tampa, Florida, because I thought you were going to be there. All right, goodbye. Douchebags. Sorry, sorry, we're not going to see you. Mm. That's the guy you hang out with? Jesus. Well, I'm trying you out. <laughs> well, All right. now it's your turn. Let's see how good you do. I'll just shut my mouth. I can't go wrong. No, That's just how you... be yourself, I'll be, I'll asshole. Be... All right, thank you. Get in there and fight for your life. Okay. <laughs> well, I get up every morning with a heart on because I'm horny. Grab my Vandaline and then get busy. Then I hear a voice I love. I grab my cock and start to rub and think I'm robbing with those big brown titties. <laughs> I see my Tinkling Robin's glitter is every day. Tinkling Robin.